वेलकम टू दिस वीडियो दिस इज लेक्चर नंबर 45 ऑलरेडी 44 लेक्चर आर कवर्ड टू सॉल्व द सप्लीमेंटरी प्रॉब्लम ऑफ द बुक वेक्टर इनिशियल बाय द एमएल स्पाइनल यू नो दिस बुक इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर बीएससी फिजिक्स ऑनर्स एज वेल एज फॉर मैथमेटिक्स ऑनर्स आल्सो इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर द आईटीएम प्रिपरेशन ऑनर्स दैट्स व्हाई यू टू डिसाइड द सॉल्व द सप्लीमेंटरी प्रॉब्लम ऑफ दिस बुक इन दिस वीडियो यू वांट टू सॉल्व द सप्लीमेंटरी प्रॉब्लम 5.51 टू 5.53 ऑफ चैप्टर 5 व्हिच कंसिस्ट वेक्टर एनालिसिस Go to the question directly. 5.51 says, given a vector equal to this, evaluate a dot dr along this vector in the positive direction. Okay. So for that, we if we check this vector is uh, conservative or not, then we need to find out the curl of a. So what is the value of curl of a? This is i cap, j cap, k cap, del del x. Del del y, del del z, and this is y z plus two x. This is x z, and this is x y plus two z. Simple. So I cap del del y of this. This is x. Del del z of this. This is x plus j cap. Del del z of this. This is y. Del del x of this. This is also y plus k cap. Del del x of this, this is z. Del del y of this, this is also z. So this can be is zero. So a is conservative. A is conservative. Since a is conservative, then we can say a can be written as a can be written as grad phi. Okay. So integration a dot dr. This is nothing but grad phi dot dr. You know the Grad, uh, so we need to find out the uh, phi. So this is nothing but the grad phi is nothing but d phi dr, and this is dr, and this two becomes phi. Okay, so upper limit minus lower limit. Upper limit is one zero one, and this is the lower limit zero one one. So at this moment we need to find out the phi. You know, if we compare these two, i cap, j cap, k cap, then we get del phi del x is nothing but the coefficient of a, that is y z plus 2x. So here we got phi equal to, this is x y z plus x square by 2, this is x square some constant c1. Similarly, del phi del y is nothing but x z. So this becomes phi equal to x y z again with c2 del phi del z so this become x z sorry x y plus 2 z so this is x y z plus z square by 2 so this is z square plus c3 so the total phi can be written as x y z plus x square plus z square with some constant so phi at upper limit that is 1 0 1 if we put 1 0 1 this is 0 this is 1 plus 1 so 1 plus 1 plus c that is 2 plus c and phi 0 1 1 is this okay 0 1 1 okay so this is if we put this is 0 0 so 1 plus c so the difference the upper limit that is 1 0 1 minus 5 0 1 1 is nothing but 2 plus c minus 1 minus c that is 1 so this is the value of this integration go to the next one let if a, a, a e vector is equal to r r to the power 4 this mistake this must be r r vector okay this is a mistake in the book uh, printing mistake is there a function phi such that this so for that we need to check the curl of this vector so this is curl of r r vector so you know uh, curl of grad phi is gra uh, divergence uh, grad r cross r vector plus sorry r curl of r you know since gra since grad of phi curl of phi a this is the formula curl of phi a is nothing but 
ग्रेट फाइ क्रस ए प्लस फाइ कर्ल अफ ए रईट यू नो कर्ल अफ ए इज जिरो एंड दिस बिकम इज नाथिंग बस सीम्पलि डेरिवेटिव दिस इज डेरिवेटिव इज वन द डेरिवेटिव अफ दिस इज वन एंड दिस बिकम आर कैम आर कैम मीस आर भेक्टर बै आर क्रस आर सो दिस बिकम जिरो दिस इज जिरो दिस इज जिरो सो दिस इज जिरो सो दिस इज अ कन्जार्भेटिव कन्जार्भेटिव सिंस दिस इज अ कन्जार्भेटिव एंड यू नो द आईडेंटिटी कर्ल अफ ग्रेट फाइ इज जिरो सो यू कैन रईट दिस इज ए माइनस ग्रेट फाइ नो प्रब्लेम दिस कैन बी रईट एट दिस नाउ फाइंड इट फाइंड इट मीस आई उड टू फाइंड आउट दि फाइ सो यू कैन कम्पेयर दिस इक्वेशन डेल फाइ डेल एक्स डेल फाइ डेल एक्स इज द कपिशेंट अफ एक्स उथ द माइनस सैन सरि यू कैन से दिस इज इ भेक्टर इक्वल टू आर आर भेक्टर इक्वल टू दिस इज नाथिंग बट डि फाइ डि आर उथ दर कैप दिस प्रूफ इज अलरेडी डान इन द प्रिवियस मेनी लेक्चार्स मेनी प्रिवियस लेक्चार सो यू कैन कम्पेयर दिस आर भेक्टर इज आर आर कैप सो दिस इज आर स्कोर इक्वल्स टू माइनस डि फाइ डि आर so you can say phi is nothing but minus integration r square dr so this is minus r cube by 3 with some constant c this is the function phi now we need to find out this integration for a simply closed car so this is answer of question a for question b we need to find out the closed integral of e dot dr so e can be written as the grad phi minus grad phi no problem dot dr and you know grad phi is nothing but d phi dr into r cap and this dr also r cap dr so dr dr r, this is one dr dr can so you get d phi which is closed closed integral this means this limit to r same this limit to r same limit is upper limit and lower limit since these two are same so this become zero clear go to the next one so that this function is exact differential so prove to, to prove that this is a exact differential this is need to be a uh, form of grad phi so for that we need to find out the curl of this so curl of this vector if you take this is a vector so this is i cap j cap k cap del del x del del y actually this is nothing but a dot dr right this is nothing but a dot dr so that's why we want to prove the curl of a is zero if we prove that then this will be exact differential so the coefficient of x is 2x cos y this is sorry 2x cos y plus z sin y this is x z cos y minus x square sin y and this is x sin y so i cap uh, sorry take write down here i cap del del y of this sin y so this become x cos y x square x square no 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 x x right x cos y and del del z of this so this become x cos y plus j cap del del z of this so this is sin y and del del x of this this is sin y plus k cap del del x of this this will become z cos y Minus two x sin y, and then del y of this, so this is minus of minus so plus two x sin y, and minus j cos y. So we can see this become zero. Since this is zero, so this is a exact differential. So the given equation, given equation. is exact differential okay exact differential hence solve the differential equation 
so to, to solve this differential equation we know this can be written as grad phi so a can be written as grad phi so del del x del phi del x del phi del x can be 2 x cos y plus z sin y so if we integrate with respect to x we get with respect to x we get x square by 2 this is x square cos y and this is x z sin y similarly del phi del y is nothing but x z cos y minus x square sin y so with respect to y if we integrate this is uh, x z sin y uh, with respect to y, this is plus x square cos y similarly del phi del z this is nothing but x sin y so this will become uh, there must be a constant c1 c2 and this is x z sin y c3 so in this combination we can write the total phi can be written as x square cos y plus x z sin y with some this is cos y plus x z sin y there is no another extra term with some constant this is the required phi clear and okay this is the total solution Let's solve the differential equation okay that's it. this is all about me this is my contact details you can contact with me by whatsapp or telegram for query or any physics related question this is my youtube channel details go to this channel you get all the videos which are already uploaded subscribe this channel and press the bell icon to this uh, get the video when i upload it and share this video to your friends so that he or she also get benefit from this video take care we will meet in the next video as soon as possible thank you